Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name's Lippy Lou and welcome back to my bathroom. Um, so basically today, this tutorial is not about how to look amazing with my hair. No, um, it's basically my skincare routine. So the cat's here, sorry. Um, so this is a skincare, this is what I do to get my skin a little bit because it gets really dry here and um, it's just it gets spotty it does get spotty and as I've told you before I do have scars from spots so um, basically this is just my skincare routine um, I do use simple so I do use uh, simple uh, so I do use that on a regular basis um, so when I've come out of the shower, which I have just done, um, wash my hair, feeling good, um, basically I've gone to the sink to actually just do my face, scrub my face, get all the horrible stuff out from the day's work, uh, <laughs> works loosely in, uh, in context there. I am in my pyjamas, so I do apologise for my appearance, um, but uh, hey, every girl loves their pyjamas. Um, first of all, I would like to introduce you to somebody. Come on. This is Harley. This is the newest member of our family. Uh, we have got another cat called Logan, but he is an outdoor cat, so he is out at the moment. Uh, Harley, Harley, say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Yeah, she's crazy. Um, <laughs> she's doing my nails at the moment, bless her, but I love her to bits. She's my little Harley Quinn. Yes, I love that kind of character. So I'm gonna put you down and we'll let you go out. I'll just leave her there. So um so I thought I'd introduce you to her and now let's get on with the favourite routine. So first of all I do get I'm not peeing, this is the tap going. In. Um so I do get the, um a nice warm sort of lukewarm water to open up the pores. Uh, I have been recommended that. And uh, so um, basically that's what I'm doing at the moment. Um, I also use anti-blemish mud, uh, which is that, quick, flesh, quick fix anti-blemish mud. Um, this is uh, found at Sainsbury's, I think. Um, and I do like it, it leaves your skin really nice and silky smooth. It's cheap, it's not your most expensive everyday thing. So, um, but, all the, all the uh, skin sort of elements that I'm going to be using today are all going to be by Simple. A nice easy brand and it's really nice on your skin. So I am going to be using that. Um, sometimes um, I do use a facial scrub, which again is Simple, which is this one here. I'm not going to be using the scrub today because I did do it the other day. So um, that is what I use as a facial scrub. Now the reason I use Simple is because one, that's what it says on the tin. It's simple. And also as well, at the same time, it just has, it, it's hypoallergenic, first of all. And also as well, it's it's just, it, it's for all skin types. It's not just a complicated, oh, do you have oily skin? Do you have dry skin? Do you have normal skin? It's a really nice, simple, simple uh, brand uh, that I do get from either Boots or Superdrug or wherever you can find it, but it is in the high street shops and it's nice and affordable. So I'm going to be using that now. The tap has got quite hot now <laughs> that I've been talking away, so I'm just going to mix that. Don't get hot water though; it's um, it will be burning on your skin basically. So I'm just going to mix that with a little bit of cold. Just going to turn that off. Mix it with a little bit of cold. Again, I am not peeing, <laughs> and Harley is playing at my feet, so, as you can hear, <laughs> you can probably hear that, she probably just ran into the door. Um, so I've got nice warm water here, so first of all, we're just going to open up the pores. Okay, so I'm just going to... Wow, so that's me, just found my laptop. Um, so that's me opening up my pores. Now, first of all, what I'm going to use is cleanser. So this is a cleanser, and it comes in a nice little easy pump bottle. And uh, it's really, as I say, it's really nice to use. So I give it a couple of squirts of that. 
just take it in my hand like that and just rub it all over your face. Now you want to try and avoid the eyes, um, even with a hypoallergenic cleanser, I've got some in my hair, some will cleanse my hair again. Even with a hypoallergenic cleanser, there is some little bit of alcohol in it, so you don't want to get it near the eyes, which I have. Ouch! <laughs> so I'm just going to leave that on for a couple of moments. Um, before this, I did do my teeth. Um, I am still using... <laughs> Look at that. It looks like I dribbled. Um, I still, I'm still using the charcoal powder. Um, and as you can see, <laughs> I'm starting to think it's nothing's changed. That's the only problem. It's just, oh, I've just, I've kind of given up on my teeth. My teeth are absolutely horrible, so. <laughs> um, but I will keep smiling, though. Doesn't matter how yellow my teeth are, I will keep smiling. So that's been on just for a couple of moments there, um, just to let it set in and get rid of them nice. Just get rid of um, all the stuff that, like makeup, dirt. You, <laughs> it's amazing the amount of dirt that is in the air, basically. So I'm just gonna go back to the warm water, take it all off, and then I'm gonna get some cold water and close my pores up. So. That's it all off my face. Strand bit of hair. I'm getting water all over my laptop. Right, so I'm just going to take the cold water now. If you do this in the morning as well, the cold water really wakes you up. And um, let me just grab a towel. And you don't want to wipe your skin, you just want to pat it. Pat it dry. dry. <laughs> yep, got the laptop dry. Yeah, there we go. So, okay. So that's step one, cleanser. Again, it looks like I've dribbled down my top. Basically, my hair's wet. I've just been splashing my face with water. Give us a break, okay? Um, so, um, the next thing that I use, if I can find it, is toner. So what I do use is a little bit of that with a little bit of this and I've just realised my cupboard door is open so you don't want to see in there. Right, okay then, so, so you've got the toner, a little bit of cotton. And you just go all over your face. Um, so pay attention to where you um, you do get sort of oily skin because everybody does get oily skin. Um, that is the most that it's affected. So um, I'm usually T zone and my nose here. Uh, I always get spots there. I've always get spots around my chin here as well. So I'm really focusing on them sort of spots. And as you can see, oh, can you see it? Nastiness. I can see it very clearly here and it's nastiness all over the cotton bar. So that is going to the loo. Now just let that dry naturally. Let it seep into your skin. Usually at this point, if I use a little bit too much toner, I usually give my skin a pat as well. So I'm just going to do that. And there we go. Now the last step that I do use is a, a moisturiser. Again, because they're awesome, I'm going to use Simple. So it's just, as I said to you guys before, I rave about this. Can you? There you go. I rave about this brand because um, I've used the makeup wipes. I've used the, uh, I've used all sort of facial skin, I've used a body wash, I've used everything and I have to admit I just think it's a brand that really sticks out and is affordable. I wouldn't say cheap but I would say affordable so um, 
I, I use it all the time. The makeup wipes are amazing as well. They really get right into your skin. I mean, like what, taking your makeup off. Now, just done that. Just put uh, like a 50 pence piece, or a 10 pence piece on my hand. I smooshed it together. Now I'm get really dry here. For some strange reason, I've got a spot right in my dry patch. Uh, but as I say, I get really dry there. So I'm just going to start there. Just work my way up. Really. Yeah. Where's the hair come from? I molt when I wash my hair as well. So hair is everywhere. So um, this is the chance to give yourself a little bit of a facial rub. So, I know you want somebody else doing it, but hey ho, we can't have everything. So, really just, I usually do it in little circles as well to get right into the pores and draw right into the dry bits. Um, I don't do my lips, I actually put a lip balm on after this because I, um, when I get chapped lips, I do do suffer from chapped lips very badly so I do put a uh, ch uh, chapstick on basically because it sometimes burns so um right so wipe the excess off your hands and really that is it that is that is my skincare routine um as I say I do use a little bit of Nivea chapstick um so put that a little bit on and it's got in rows so gives you a little bit of a him Okie dokie, right, so that is my skincare routine, it's it's nothing fancy, it's nothing big, it's nothing extra mild, but it's something that you can do every day, it's not, um, it's, it's not anything that you have to take hours and hours to prepare and do and maybe leave the uh, cleanser on for a little bit longer, I usually do, but for the sake of this video I've just left it on for a sort of a minute, minute and a bit, I usually leave it on for about, um, a good couple of minutes really to five minutes um but as i say it's just it's an amazing it's an amazing feeling when you go to bed and you're lying there and you just think oh the skin feels nice oh this is nice especially when you've got clean sheets clean pajamas you girls out there know what i'm talking about um and you wash your hair you're all washed and you can feel your skin and you just go hmm it's nice but as i say that is my skincare routine um, as I say, I am really apologise for the hair. I have just got out of the shower, as you can tell. <laughs> um, but basically, I've got a few things coming up. Um, I'm going to be doing a few character makeup tutorials. Um, and I'm not going to tell you what they are until a little bit further in. I'm also going to be doing character-inspired makeup. So something that you could probably wear when you go out. Or um, even if you don't want to do full makeup. Um, such as like face paints or anything like that, you can do this sort of inspired look. Um, also as well, um, I'm going to be trying to get the Teeth Whitener um, series again. Um, and I've been uh, told about a little stick that you can get from the pound shop for some strange reason. And you just rub it all over your teeth and apparently it's meant to be amazing. So I'm going to be looking at that as well. Um, also as well, um, I've got uh, my wedding coming up in August. I am getting married. Um, so I'm going to be trying out a few new makeups, but also I want to be doing a tutorial on how I'm possibly going to be doing my makeup for the wedding because I don't like anybody else doing my makeup. Um, so uh, that's it. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel. And I'm Lippy Lou and thank you very, very much for watching.